hey guys uh, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to show you how you can uh, add elastic IP to your AWS instance so this is my instance I've launched on Ubuntu um, instance so what it, uh, elastic IP is actually is so how does it work so let me just give you an overview so as soon as you launch an instance in AWS you will you get a public IP which is it and this one is a private IP so unless and until you reboot your instance this public IP is fixed but after you uh, shut down this instance or stop this instance this public IP will go away and there will be a new uh, public IP uh, which will be assigned to your AWS instance so this way uh, you will not be uh, you can cannot host a website or something uh, otherwise after you reboot these um, those website will be invalid as the back uh, the backend IP will be inval invalid so there must be a uh, solution for this so the solution is elastic IP address so what elastic IP address is this is a general public IP address but this I public IP address will be dedicated to your account so you can uh, you can assign to any of your instances so let me just create uh, let me show you the wait a second okay so let me just give you an example so this is my current public IP address so if I stop this instance just wait and watch if I stop this instance so this is the IP okay so it will take some time so in between let me just allocate a new elastic IP address okay I have one so this one is our elastic IP address I'll be assign it to this instance later just let me just finish it so it is stopped now so there is no IP address and this one sorry so this one this was the last IP address so let me just start the instance So see, the IP address has been changed. This one, the old one, and this is the new one. But if I assign this IP to the instance, it will not be changed. So let me show you. So go to access, select this, and go to action. As I'm having only one instance, it will show only one. If you have multiple instance, you have multiple uh, instance ID. So you have to choose in between. So uh, I need to specify the private IP address, which is this one. Okay. And you can either check, or if you don't want, you can. Okay, so this IP address has been associated. Now, see, so let me 
Let me stop this instance. It's taking a bit of time. Okay, now they stopped. So let me just start it. Yes. So now it's running. So you can see the IP address is remain same as this one. So this is how Elastic IP works. So thanks for watching. If you have any question, you can comment below. Thanks.